Hey guys, it's Allie from Little Hill Homestead. Have you ever seen the little kids book called Everybody Poops or Everyone Poops or whatever it's called? Well, today on our channel, we're going to be talking about poop. I have all boys in my house typically, and so this is a funny topic usually. But today we're being really serious because <laughs> for Christmas in July day, I don't even know what we're on at this point. We're going to be making homemade poopery or poop spray or toilet spray. You call it whatever you want to call it. I call it before you go spray. And so these are those little amber bottles that we got on Amazon. I'll link them below. We've used them for a couple of our um, Christmas gift ideas. But um, all I did was to use a P-Touch label and I stuck a before you go spray, shake and spray five times label on it. I'm thinking this with like a, P a roll of toilet paper, maybe a magazine. Okay, that's ridiculous. We're not actually going to go there. But for this one, this one's a really cheap one. If you guys look at the cost of poopery, like the actual stuff, it's kind of astronomical. We like to put this in our guest bathrooms. Um, I also like if you work with a lot of people, this is a really good one to maybe wrap a bow on and stick in your office restrooms at Christmas time. Um, and maybe it will stay there. Probably not. Some, probably somebody will jack it, but it's fine. You know, it is what it is. It's cheap. It's easy. You can put it in a plastic squirt bottle, but the essential oils are going to break that down. So I suggest glass. Anyways, here we go. Here's your recipe for, let's call it bathroom spray. It sounds a little bit better. Um, you can also, the sense that, have I done the room sprays yet? Has that come out to you guys yet? I don't know. The scents that we use for our room sprays, the Christmas scent of room sprays, if that is out, those scents all apply to this recipe as well. So um, I have a little bottle. I'm going to do half and half going in the bottle of water. So half a bottle is just going to be water. For my little bottle, so eight ounces, so that's four ounces of water. This is um, witch hazel. You can also use vodka, which I think is kind of a weird place to use vodka, but you need something to break up the oils um, that we're going to be using. You can also use rubbing alcohol, which is cheap, and you can get a huge bottle of it for not much. Okay, so i got four ounces of each of those. The next thing you're going to need is some kind of surfactant. This is a, a, basically a soap or something that's going to help it kind of glide across the top of the water when you spray it. So this is going to be Dr. Bonner's unscented Castile soap. You can use any Castile soap. If you don't have Castile soap, use dish soap. It's kind of going to work the same way. So I'm just going to do a squirt of that. I would say, I don't know, a couple teaspoons of that. Whoops. Or I'm going to accidentally fill the bottle. Let me dump a little of that out. Okay. My bad on that one. So that was our Dr. Bonner's or your Castile soap. So to this, you can really go any, <laughs> my husband's looking at me like, are you really making a poop spray video? Yes, I am. <laughs> um, to this, we are going to add essential oils and that's going to be citruses do really well with odor eliminating. Pine does really <laughs> well with odor eliminating. Um, think strong scents. And so for today, this is our favorite recipe. Recipe sounds wrong when you're talking about deodorizing spray. Um, I like bergamot. It has um, kind of like a piney type of a scent, but it's kind of a luxurious type of a scent. So you're going to use basically 10 drops of each of your essential oils. So I'm going to do 10 drops of bergamot. Okay. Next, we're going to use lemongrass because, like again, I said citrus is a great um, coverer. And then the last thing I'm going to use for this concoction is grapefruit. I tend to really like grapefruit. I don't know why. You can use tangerine too. In case you want to be a happy pooper. My word. Things I never thought I'd say on the internet. <laughs> so um, all you're going to do is put your little lid on there and give it a little shake. Now, the Dr. Bonner's is going to mix in, or your Castile soap is going to mix in with your witch hazel and stuff. I remember I spilled this, so I made a mess. But basically, that's it. It's got a nice citrusy smell. It's kind of just neutral. It's not going to be overwhelming. You don't want like it to smell like a freaking candy, cotton candy farm in your bathroom when you go. Okay, this is just getting ridiculous now. Um, another couple recipes that we really like would be the 10 drops of each using eucalyptus, which basically is the smell of a urinal disc, if you've ever smelled one of those, fun fact. Um, peppermint and lavender, that is a good 
combination. And then lemon, rosemary, and spearmint is the other one that we tend to really like. The spearmint is quite strong. And so it's another good one. <laughs> My word. These, I just can't even believe. I thought this would be a good idea until I actually started doing it. But anyways, so that is our before you go poopery dupe. Um, you guys look up the cost of poopery. I think it's like around, I saw it in an antique store locally not too long ago. It was like $17 a bottle. This cost me about $2 to make. Two bucks. What I like is the, the jar is reusable. And so you can make this a million times and um, use the same container. So anyways, that's our video for today. Five minutes. You got one Christmas gift. If you're doing a bunch of these, just line them up and you could you could really knock out a bunch of these at the same time. Like I said, if you want to go to Dollar Tree and look for any kind of just squirt bottle that works as well, it just is not going to hold the essential oils quite as well. And this looks a little bit prettier tucked. We have a basket that sits with toilet paper above our toilet and we just tuck this in there and it looks nice. They come in blue too, if you're a fan of blue. Anyways, there you go. There's our before you go poopery dupe. Thanks for watching. If you guys have any comments, comment below. If you're new to our channel, hit subscribe, hit like, comment below. We love to hear from you guys. Thanks for watching.